pilots from Columbus Air Force Base eject safely from their aircraft. That plane went down this morning near the base. WCBI's Jory Talley has been near the scene all morning. She joins us now live with the latest. That's right. We're over here on Highway 373 near the Lowndes County Monroe County lines. As you can see behind me, there's still a heavy law enforcement present and first responder presence. Now, the Columbus Air Force Base has confirmed two pilots crashed in a T-38C earlier this morning about 8.30. It has been confirmed that they did evacuate safely from the plane. One of the sergeants with the Air Force Base, Sergeant Joshua Smoot, told us that they were taken to the hospital. It's still not known if there was any injuries. Kind of repeating everything that I said, the base has confirmed that the plane is a T 38C Italian 2. That plane crashed about 8 30 this morning near the base. Local law enforcement and first responders are still here out on the scene before we made it over here onto this side of the, the site, which we're about a mile away from the actual crash site. We were on the property line of the Columbus Air Force Base and Barton Ferry Road. That's in northern Lowndes County. The media was pushed back. We were about two miles um, from that site over there. We're still trying to develop more information, and we're going to be gathering that and hopefully bringing you the very latest at 5 and 6 tonight on WCBI News. But for now, reporting live here in Lowndes County, Jory Talley, WCBI News. All right, Jory, thanks for that update. Now